Yo, what's up? This is Cam, and y'all are tuned in to Carolina Fragrance Reviews. I have been tagged four for life from one house. Chad, you dirty scoundrel. Why would you do this to me? I'm going to get you, son. Okay. Why do people do these tags? I don't know. But, hey, it's fun. And I appreciate you tagging. Chad, thank you so much from A Gentleman's Journey. Thank you for coming out and tagging me in this video. I have something up my sleeve on who I'm gonna tag. Yeah, this is gonna get pretty interesting. What do you guys think my house is? Parfum, Mr. Marley? Creed? Chanel? What do you guys think? Stay tuned, you'll find out. The house that I picked that I feel most represents my personality is by Killian. Yes, their darker fragrances most represent my personality, but Love the Way You Taste is a great spring and summer fragrance, and I could probably rock that out for, you know, I don't know, for the majority of it. And Back to Black is safe enough to wear year round in my humble opinion, because you know, I like to, I don't know, I like to shake things up a little bit. The first one I'm gonna start off with is from the Miami Vice collection. Love the way you taste was launched in 2018. The notes are lemon, mint, magnolia, and vetiver. Whether you like Ricardo Tubbs or Sonny Crockett, which I used to dress like Sonny Crockett when I was a kid, Miami Vice was a show that I watched when I was a kid. I know I'm telling on my age a little bit, but hey, I could be talking about Jamie Foxx and Colin Farrell, right? But yeah, this is a sophisticated cocktail that smells just like a mojito that has lemon and peppermint and that opening blast. And it is a nice, fresh and clean, sophisticated summer and spring fragrance. I absolutely adore this. It is a awesome, freshy, Killian don't put out that many freshies. They did put out the Miami Vice line, and let me tell you something, guys. They are doing away with 11 fragrances at Killian, and the Miami Vice edition is part of it. So if you guys don't have these and you want them, if you're a Killian fan, yeah, you might want to get your hands on these, but in my humble opinion, this is the best of the Miami Vice edition. You guys know how I am about my tobacco fragrances and I have another one that is going to be discontinued. It sucks, cause this one's great. Light My Fire. Light My Fire was launched in 2014. The notes are cumin, hay, patchouli, vetiver, honey, vanilla, and tobacco. Yes, this one is another one that is gonna drop off the map that you better get your nose on before it's too late. I do have a source that is very, very reliable that has told me that 11 fragrances from Killian are gonna be, they're gonna have a sit down with them. Let's just put it like that. But yes, this one has vanilla and tobacco and vetiver and honey. It is an amazing, amazing fragrance. The only thing that I dislike about this particular fragrance is the longevity of the performance is a bit lacking. Maybe five to six hours, but the Siage, when you put this on, boy, I'm telling you what, this is why I like Killian so much. These openings on these fragrances are insane. The dry downs are even better. If I had one complaint about Killian as a house, it would be the performance and the longevity. And that's just because in those first five to six hours in a fragrance like this right here, Oh my gracious, this is insanity. This is so, so good. But yeah, this is one that you'll put on at night. Five or six hours, man, if you can't get the job done in five or six hours, you better take your butt back to the house. Don't be prowling out at the club. This is a one that is a alpha male, make your statement. You should be able to get whatever you need to get done in like two hours as far as you're prowling. You have already locked, sealed, and delivered the deal. Light my fire. Speaking of sealing the deal, oh yeah, baby. 
Back to Black. Aphrodisiac. Back to Black was released in 2009. Some of the notes are bergamot, saffron, nutmeg, cardamom, honey, cedar, oat, tobacco, patchouli, almond, vanilla, and laudanum. Yeah, if you don't get it in a title and you don't get it done with this one, you don't have any game. I don't mean to be like a prick when I say that, but I'm just saying this is that good and it does get drastic reactions. I have personally had a lot of luck with the ladies on this as far as compliments. We'll just leave it at that. Compliments. Ladies love this fragrance. Ladies like to wear this. Yes, most of the Killian stuff is unisex. Some of it is geared towards women. Some of it is geared towards men. The majority of it is considered unisex. But with the right swagger, you walk in a room with back to black, aphrodisiac. <sighs> yeah, man, this just screams my personality. They're dark, they're mysterious, they're seductive. That is what Killian represents. That's what my personality represents. Enough about me, let's talk about Killian. Back to black, baby, we'll get to the last one. Okay, so we got our freshy. We got our tobacco fragrance. And we've got our, mm, our aid, if you will, as we go out. Now we have to have our gourmand, but it also has that dark rum in there and everything else, which I personally find Black Phantom to be a very seductive and very mysterious fragrance. Black Phantom was released in 2017. Some of the notes are rum, sugar cane, dark chocolate, coffee, Caramel, almond, and sandalwood. It is by far probably the best fragrance I have ever smelled. The first time that I tried it out, I, I, honestly, I was not sure if I liked it, but there is something highly addictive about this fragrance. When I first put it on, I was like, okay, okay, okay. And I just wanted to keep just like putting it on. And just just, 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 just doing like that. I couldn't get enough of it. Yeah, that's a little bit insane. Don't you dare do that. I'm just doing this for entertainment value, but that's how good and how addictive this stuff is. I'm serious. If you have not smelled Black Phantom, get out from underneath that rock that you're under and get your nose on Black Phantom. So these were my four for life. Now, who am I gonna tag? I would say I would tag somebody that hates to be tagged. Cuba. Shh. Somebody who has previously tagged me. Cuba. Shh. How about my homie over at Kubano? Yeah, homie. You get tagged back. I don't like being tagged. You don't like being tagged. We both getting tagged. Cause tag your it, homie. What's your house, player? All right, Chad, thank you for tagging me. Kuba, it's down to you now, homie. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Subscribe to Chad's channel. Subscribe to everybody's channel. Kuba's all them fools. Yeah, that's what's up. We'll see you next time on Carolina Fragrance Reviews.